The labor movement says it's engaged close to 40,000 workers in the past year in a bid to establish a so-called workers' compact to represent their voices well ahead. More attention will also be given to younger people. Labor chief Ng Chi Ming sat down with Clara Lee to give us insights about what was said at the May Day rally. Whether you are PME, a freelancer, whether you are a caregiver, uh, I even gone to the prisons to meet with some of the inmates and now also looking at how to move some of these uh, sisters and brothers back into a productive workforce. So we have made good progress in these spaces. We hope to do not just a conversation but take concrete action uh, in the next uh, phase of Singapore's development. Well, he says more work will be done with youths. Youths being a large group of Singaporeans coming out of school or national service and forming the future workforce. And NTUC has already engaged some 10,000 of them to hear their views. They have expressed the needs that they hope that NTUC can do together with them. Career opportunities, workplace uh, adaptation, finances, mental well-being. And specific to these career aspirations, well, we are starting the career uh, starter lab pilot to uh, see how we can value add in this space. Flexible work arrangements or FWAs will also remain a focus. NTUC hopes to better define the type of work and salaries, especially to help specific groups such as caregivers. We hear and understand and empathize with the needs of the caregivers and mostly our sisters. The pressures of work, career and sometimes not just aged parents but kids as well. So we think that flexible work arrangements, structured and flexible, in a more negotiable fashion with employers where both sides have a good understanding of what FWA means, how we can tailor needs will be very, very helpful.